In this video, I attempt to make glue using birch bark oil. The oil is extracted by heating bark from paper birch, Betula papyrifera, without oxygen. This is achieved with a large tin can and an aluminum foil lid with a hole. I had sunk a collection reservoir into the fire pit to catch the oil. When researching this video, other people referred to the extract as either oil or tar. According to PubChem, the two terms are synonymous, with no chemical difference. The difference is in viscosity alone. Also needed for this project is charcoal. Charcoal is made by heating wood without oxygen, so I employ a second tin can and foil lid. No hole in the lid this time. I heat the cans for about two hours before removing them from the fire. Heating materials without oxygen prevents complete combustion and for the materials to decompose to simpler components in a process known as pyrolysis, an oxidation reaction. The reservoir has collected a small amount of birch oil, and the wood has turned into charcoal. The next step is to turn the charcoal into powder. This is achieved by crushing the large pieces down to manageable size and grinding them. After grinding, the charcoal powder is mixed with the oil to make a thick paste and then applied to the wood. Other uses for the oil include waterproofing materials, fire starters, insect repellent, and it is speculated to have antiseptic properties. The unfortunate part about this glue is that it takes about a week to cure and solidify, so it is not my favorite type of glue in the world. Womp womp. Until next time.